Hello and welcome back to Bard's Tale 4. Yeah, we are still going further and further into the forest. Oh, new enemy. Goodbye. For now. Twenty seven, that's not enough. Tell me what you need. On your word. Fifteen EU to this. Twenty two. We can start with this, I think. Oh, it's a warlock. Uh, you're dead. You just killed yourself. Oh, yeah, that's all. Stand aside. Oh, that's fine. Oh, he can even hit you. That's impressive. Uh, but I would like you to get over there. I still want her here because she hits hard. How did that happen? Of course, now I understand what they meant by... Alright, mm, by... What was that maze with no turns? God damn it. Yes, I'm fighting the plant. Oh, no, 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 I really need to make some alcohol. I really need to make some alcohol. If you don't have any magical, you don't have any magical attack. That's bad. Command me. Okay, best I can do is this. He <laughs> well, they cannot cast spells when they are dead. Tell me. Come on, you tinkers! Oh, let's go, 
Okay. I need to heal him. He will hit this, but it doesn't matter. Um, will you do swap? Yep. So close! Wait, what? He's still alive? Oh, I forgot that we leveled up. Now, let's see. You would like Dart the Fighter? Upon taking melee damage, you strike back at the attacker for 16 physical damage. And this is passive. You cannot land that. Hmm. Why you have those bow? You need all three? Hmm. I don't want that. Oh no, I think she cannot learn that at all. Let's give you some more constitution. Yes, okay, so we need to do the review board for each character in our party. I get you, I get you. That makes sense. Magically blocked. Oh. Wait, I'm trying to understand what's happening. Ah. Somewhere wait. wait I need to go back. Here, here. Hey. Nope. Nothing, I suppose. Yes, yes, nothing, because I need to heal. And I like having the upper hand when we start those fights. She has 13 health. I need to stop preparing. And I forgot to make alcohol. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it's like that. Well, she's dead. You're still dead. I'll need you to heal, but first things first, let's you'll do this. Oh, 
she's almost dead. How much is that? 31. So, as long as she doesn't die, she stacks those bonuses, I think. And it doesn't help that I'm always keeping her on the verge of death. Now here we have a shortcut. And or foe. Not if what the heck is that? Keep back, strangers. The poor Gilly had to kill it before it reached the village. What's wrong with it? Usually Gilly Doo are the gentlest creatures in the wood. Caretakers, really. They make the trees grow. But they've caught the corruption. And now everywhere they go, they spread it. I hate to have to put one down, but we'd no choice. Where is your village? Just beyond those trees. I'm Father Rife, war leader and chief hunter. My wife's name is Mother. You outsiders would call her Mayor, I suppose. See her if you have any business with us. Sure, thank you. Stay on the path. The woods are sick and full of danger. Okay. I'm pretty sure I had no option to stray off the path. You again? It's safer. Yeah, I would like to. Unfortunately, my home isn't safe either. We are all the way here. Okay, I thought this map would be bigger than it really is. Hey. Outsiders. I've got some gear here from the last fools who thought they could survive the entry act. You interested? Fools? What do you mean? Nah, it happens all the time. Hunters or treasure seekers come north, thinking they'll just stroll into the greenwood and take what they want. Then they die screaming in the dark, not knowing what ate them. And I come along, pick up their gear and sell it to the next band of merry idiots. <laughs> Some of these things I've sold five times over. You want a look? Sure. So you lead people into danger so you can loot their corpses. What? Are you suggesting I had something to do with their demise? Tch, why do work I don't have to? The forest kills them without any help from me. Here you are. Oh, recipe. I like that. I would like the token. Give me all your herbs. I think that will be... Oh, I'll sell you my useless stuff.
I like it. <laughs> and I'm a sucker for rare items. Thank you. <sighs> oh, no, okay. God damn it, I really have no idea where I can and cannot go. Now, here's a likely crew. You, friends, look like you need some armor. The whole lot of you. And I'm the man to sell it to you. Please. Let me sell you some armor. And yes, I know it's not up to dwarvish or elvish standards, but it's good enough for everyday work. Please? You're begging? I... I admit I'm a bit desperate. You see, my brother and I came up here to the Inch Reac, both boasting that we were such fine salesmen that we could sell arms and armor to the Secti. Well, it hasn't worked out so well for either of us, but I'm damned if I'm going back home to Scarabray with less coin than Elbert, so I gotta make some sales. And I'll tell you true, Elbert's weapons aren't the best quality either, so there's no need to be buying from him. Dwarfish standards. Well, I know your kind is used to better, but it's good quality, and at prices humans can afford. Please, let's make a deal. Well, those are not horrible, I think. We have no berserkers, though. No swissers. Elven. Hmm. Okay, that will be useful. Thank you. Buy for my brother. I will decide that. No, nothing. Okay. All right. Let's equip her with her new shoes. Those are just boots. Right. You have. Oh. Yes. You can't wear those, you can't wear those. Need something? Oh reinforced leather. Never mind. I don't want to know. After the giant rat, I don't want to know. He really is drifting off into the distance. Those are the little things that make the world more believable, you know? The some of the actions are being finished. Place of a weapon, place of worship, place of trees, stuffter of children, smoke of the breeze. have sought me out instead of trespassing and consorting with our enemies. What do you want? We seek our reliquary hidden in the charnel ruin. 
the houses of the charn are forbidden. Cursed, none may enter them. We must reach the realm of the elves, so we may bring them a warning. The Fichte have promised the elves we will never reveal the way to their realm. You will get no answer from me. Of what enemies you speak? Outcasts from our tribe who practice forbidden magic. Our war with them is unending. Other strangers have entered the Ishirch? Southern cultists. Reeking of charn corruption and seeking a charn ruin known as Ewan Reg. We tried to stop their trespass, but with the aid of the Siambradu they killed many warriors and entered the ghost wood. How do I know you are not more of the same? Let us prove our good intentions. Give us a test. Set us a task. Good intentions? <laughs> As if any outsider ever has. Well, why not? There is one opinion of you I will trust. That of the goddess Mathan, protector of our tribe. Find her priestess, Leo Slate the Strong. She will lead you to... Mathan protect us. Mathan strike down our enemies. Mathan keep safe our sacred places. She will lead you to Mathan's Glade. If the goddess grants her blessing, I will help you. If she does not... <laughs> Then you will be no longer trouble me. May Mathan embrace you, strangers. Level up. Only to God. Gods are ineffable, intangible. Who knows? Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. So you cannot go over here either. We have that ready for you. More constitution, I guess. Could have granted him more more class. Why not? Intelligence, so she can cast better spells. Grant War Chanter. Can I get a stance gain? Grants plus five armor. Living distance removes. Yeah, okay. Please don't interrupt any NPC anymore. Thank you. <laughs> the outsiders. I hear I am to take you to the Glade of Mathan. <laughs> you know, Mother Main is hoping you will be eaten. She seems a hard woman, Mother Nain. Ah, uh, many things threaten the Fichte. She's hard because she thinks on these threats day and night. It would sour anyone. Tell us of Mathan. Mathan is the guardian of the forest. From her the Fichte learnt to hunt salmon in the streams and gather berries and honey in the forests. From her we learn to protect ourselves with thick coats and sharp claws, and how to raise our cubs strong and vigilant. I am pledged to her. She is my heart. Matan lives in a glade? Unlike the gods of weaker races, our gods live here in the forest, alive and real, the greatest of the beasts. The Glade of Mathan is where Mathan hunts, and we enter it respectfully, or we do not leave it alive. Then let us be off. E. Great. Yes. Let me join you, and I will guide you there. Great. Welcome, Priestess. You live up to your name, don't you? Thank you all. Let's go this way first. I'll talk to you in a moment. Or actually I'm gonna end this part here, so for now thank you very much. Stay alive and 
See you soon. Bye.